I'm Brianna Smith, your neighborhood reporter in Caldwell. Caldwell ISD is trying to figure out the fate of this old rock gym behind the elementary school. So I'm putting the clues together to get an idea of what the future could hold for it. What is one memory that you'll always remember um, just about the gym over behind the elementary school? Probably playing uh, seventh and eighth grade basketball in it. We started with like little dribblers and little diggers. That's where we always had our games at. The old rock gym behind Caldwell Elementary is full of memories, but now its existence is in question. I started looking into the fate of the building after seeing several people asking about it on Facebook. Turns out the building's foundation shifted again, raising safety issues. But to the community, it's not surprising considering its history. Rock Gym, I think everybody in town knows if you just say the Rock Gym, um, they know what building you're talking about. And it's, I mean, it's been basically a part of Caldwell history for so long. The Works Project Administration built the gym in 1942. Since then, it served as a junior high and high school and as a meetup for volleyball and basketball games. Now it's home to three organizations, including the Boys and Girls Club and Caldwell ISD's Child Care Center. Right now, the district is trying to decide whether to spend at least $3 million for repairs. The district sent me a statement saying repairs could cost more, but for now are using different plans to support organizations already using the gym. I walked downtown to ask our neighbors what they think should be done. I honestly think they should restore it because the Boys and Girls Club uses it and the kids really enjoy that. My kids actually go to Boys and Girls Club. You know, I hope that in some way they can figure out how to restore it. I, I get that things get old, but I uh, feel like there's got to be a way, right? The school says it's still discussing plans for the gym, but we will keep you updated once they make a decision. I'm your neighborhood reporter in Caldwell, Brianna Smith.